I grew up with four aunties, I four, my mom and three aunties. And so I was raised basically of strong women. I lived with my grandmother and I was looking for um, gauze, gauze-like material. And what really made me stop or pause was when I found the baptismal dresses of my mom. I was able to see how a material such as the dress can somehow echo what's happening in a person's life. It's interesting, my grandmother can make all these dresses, but my mom cannot. She wanted to, but my strong grandma would say, oh, you don't touch my sewing machine. So I went into studying the subject deeply and archive what are the other clothes tell me about my personal history. I, I particularly like that my work can relate on different kinds of audience. Just looking at them and making them realize their history or their past. So I, I don't make clothes. I'm not very good in sewing them. I see it as our portrait all together. So three generations, the one who made it, the one who wore it, and me trying to figure out what happened frame it, uh, dissect it, cut it, fragment it. Somehow there's magic in the process. The conceptual ideas are there, but as an artist, you just enjoy creating. And so that's how I do it.